What is accounting? The scope and definition of accounting changes throughout time. In general, it is argued that accounting is concerned with the provision of information about the position and performance of an enterprise that is useful to a wide range of potential users in making decisions. The purpose of accounting is to identify, record, and communicate the economic events of an organization to interested users. The earliest roles of accounting information were to measure and record financial transactions and provide information for stewardship purposes. At present, accounting is generally viewed as serving the following functions. Accounting as Information System Recording Accounting systems supply a means of recording data so as to enable the production of reports or for use in calculations. For example, for the preparation of financial statements, the calculation of performance indicators on which managerial bonuses are based or for costing inventory. Classification Accounting systems assist in categorizing data so as to enable the production of reports or for use in calculations. For example, identifying whether an item is an asset or an expense or which costs should be included in inventory. Measurement Accounting systems quantify data so as to enable the production of reports or for use in calculations. For example, determining how much profit a business has earned in a year or the value of a piece of machinery. Accounting as information produced. Stewardship. Accounting systems provide information which enables owners to determine how funds entrusted to managers have been used by them and to what ends. Information for decisions. Accounting systems provide information which enables users to make decisions about the future. For example, to assist investors or managers in deciding how to allocate their limited resources. Monitoring and control. Accounting systems provide information which enables management to monitor performance and take corrective action if necessary. Performance, evaluation, and compensation. Accounting systems provide information on the performance of different individuals and parts of the business in order to determine how much managers and employees should be rewarded according to the terms of their contracts. Communication Accounting systems provide a means by which information is transmitted to users. For example, to external users via the financial statements or to external users via the budget setting process. Accounting Theory and Practice The nature of any theory is to provide a logical basis for the practice or procedure to which the theory is applied. There are two main types of accounting theory that impact the practice of accounting. Normative Theory This concerns how things should be done. For example, ideas about the meaning of economic income can influence the way in which regulators decide that accounting systems should measure profit. Positive theory. In contrast, positive accounting theory tries to explain why things are the way they are. For example, why managers choose a particular accounting method over another or choose not to invest in research and development activities. Positive accounting theory is tested by gathering and analyzing data. Accounting information and its uses. These different types of decision require different types of information. There are usually a trade-off between relevant information and reliable information. Relevant information that can influence decisions about the future or confirm the outcome of a past transaction. Reliable information then is that is free from errors and bias and which faithfully represents economic reality. Financial Accounting Financial accounting is concerned with the preparation of accounting information for the needs of users who are external to the business. Financial accounting is therefore part of financial reporting. Other aspects of financial reporting include the timing and manner in which the information is communicated. Financial accounting information tends to be prepared on a periodic basis. Most companies publish their financial statements only once a year in their annual report based on past events and historic data, comprised solely of financial information, and governed by rules and regulations. Management Accounting 
Management accounting is concerned with the preparation of accounting information for the needs of users who are internal to the business. In general, management accounting tends to be prepared frequently as and when it is needed. Most large businesses will prepare some information on a monthly basis, and many use daily accounting information. More likely to contain forward-looking information, such as forecasts and budgets. More likely to incorporate non-financial information, such as quantities of products sold or numbers of customers' complaints. Not regulated. Managers are free to produce whatever information they need in whatever format is most helpful to them, subject to available data and technology.